guys, I want to show you another part of Uganda. If you thought that you, in Uganda there is no vehicles, as our Arab bosses always keep asking, yes, that are there vehicles in Uganda? Are there cars in Uganda, guys? This is the other part of Uganda I'm showing you guys. <laughs> we too, we are blessed, guys. We are blessed. If there is any Arab who is following me, yes, get to know Uganda with me, with your girl, Sando Irene. Get to know Uganda better, guys. And if you're asking, if in Uganda we have houses, this is your plug, guys. You don't need to ask more. You just need to watch these videos and know. In Uganda, do we have houses? Do we have cars? This is your video, guys. This is your video. <laughs> yeah. Hi, guys. This is your girl, Sendo Irene, a former housemate from Saudi Arabia. I worked for two years and six months. And on this day, I have come back to Uganda. And right now, I'm outside in Tebe Airport, our Ugandan airport. And that's why I wanted to tour a little bit because I still have chance here. The person who is coming for me is not yet here. So I have that chance to make you tour around our airport, outside the airport. But before, let me show you that this is in Tebe Airport, guys. In Tebe. Airport, it is found in Uganda, in the capital city of Uganda, which is called Kampala. But it is on outskirts of Kampala, guys. And this is all its beauty right here, the bridge. And also, I love the temperatures. The temperatures here are the same temperatures all over Uganda, guys. Yes, God bless us with that gift. So we will love it so much. And if you really want to come to Uganda, hey, why not? You may contact me. This is your girl. I may go with you wherever you want and also, guys, I think you can look at this. So guys, I still have a chance. I'm still here. I'm still showing you Uganda. I'm still showing you Uganda. I'm outside our airport, guys. And I want to share with you this beauty of Uganda, guys. Yes, look at Uganda. Uganda is so green. And I'm taking you through a lot of things, guys, with me. Look. And I'm showing you just a little, a little bit of it, guys. I'm just showing you a little bit of it, guys, because this is our airport, guys. Let me show you. It is called Entebbe Airport, guys. Look. Look. This is our airport, Entebbe Airport. I'm outside it, and you have still sh seen it. Also, guys, get to see this, guys. This is you guys. <laughs> this i love the beauty i love my country and most of all i love the temperatures guys i love the temperatures that god balance the temperatures the climate of uganda so well it is so balanced and i love it right now i feel at home i feel that yes i'm feeling that africanism in me guys and i have to take you through along let me know in the comment section where are you watching my videos from guys let's interact guys as i'm taking you along through this So guys, I'm taking you through the beauty of Uganda and the beauty of our airport. Actually, we are outside the airport, guys, and that's the beauty I want to show you here. Right here, there are some flowers, and my love of flowers, especially the natural ones. So why not share with you guys? I can't leave this place without showing you this beauty, guys. So let me send the camera around, guys, so that you get to tour all this beauty from Uganda. <laughs> We are so blessed. God bless us. Guys, God bless us.
breast cells. You know when God blesses you even with the smallest thing, which you consider smallest, you have to say thank you, God, because maybe someone else will love to have that same thing you have, but she or he doesn't have it, or doesn't have access to it, or doesn't have any, any plan, or even hope to get it, guys. So that's why I'm so proud of my Uganda. That's why I'm taking you through Uganda in every single thing. So I have to thank God for every small win in my country, guys. So let me turn the camera and show you this beauty, guys. Look at that, guys. Honestly, even if you don't love flowers, even if you don't love green, look at that. Even if you don't love colors, just look at this. Guys, look at, at that red plant. Is it a plant or a flower? Get to see it well. Mkwano, see quite a damn cat. Siku kwa tide, hmm. Mposuko wabwe ya garanso vula. Hahaha. Wato chidi na mbuzi, muna yenga siku kwa tide, hmm. Yes, sebo. So guys, I think you have seen that. I, even if you don't have clear eyes, I think you can see the beauty, guys. That's why I have been yearning for my Uganda. I went south, south, south. <laughs> Sorry, guys. The joy is taking me on speed. That's why, I, the reason why I went to Saudi Arabia, it was because I couldn't get a job here in Uganda, which could meet my ends meet, which could take me far away. So that's why I opted to go to Saudi Arabia. But I love my Uganda, guys. That's why you see me happy on the very first day in Uganda, back to Uganda. That's why you see me happy. And I'm trying to share with you my happiness. Guys, you have to go with me wherever I go. <laughs> Also right here, guys, I want to show you something. This is a lake. Actually, it is called Lake Victoria. Its source is in Uganda. The district is called Ginger. That is where the source of River Nile is. That river Nile is the one which is this Lake Victoria right here and my behind. I'm going to turn the camera and zoom in so that you can get a chance to see it. Also, this lake has a lot of beaches. If you are... Um, if you are going to be on my channel, following my journey, you will see me on such beaches here. Also, guys, I would love to share with you the beauty of Uganda right here, the airport. It's my background. Very far, you can see a water border. That water border is called Lake Victoria. Lake Victoria is right here in Uganda. The river which suppresses Lake Victoria.
Hai. Halo. I think they will, they will answer in the comment section. Guys, that is one of my subscribers. You saw yesterday in my video in Saudi Arabia. That's one of my subscribers, guys. Yeah, I'm going to go to the camera and 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 I'm going to go to